And that's a really great example of why every single metal guitar player out there needs one of these, the SMG Cock Blocker Noise Gate. Now, when we originally set out, we had a 90 day pre-order, which started at September the 14th, and that's gonna still run through to December the 14th. Well, the funny thing is the demand for this thing has been so huge, we've gone way beyond what we ever expected to get. And right now our grand total is at 568. So the manufacturer has agreed to double their capacity from 500 units to 1,000 units. So if you still wanna get yourself an SMG cock blocker, they are gonna be available to December the 14th and there are plenty left. So that's so cool. I'd just like to thank the manufacturer for stepping up and agreeing to meet the demand. Now, to make things a little more interesting, I'd call uh, this kind of a life-changing event for me, not only coming down to LA, losing all this weight, and just you know living a healthier lifestyle. This thing is going to allow me to move to Los Angeles and work down here probably full time. And to commemorate that, what I'm going to do is do the 1,000 pedal challenge. And that is if I manage to sell 1,000 of these by December the 14th, I will get this emblem, not the text, just the emblem, tattooed somewhere on my body. I haven't determined where yet, but I figure, you know what, this is a life altering event. I'm gonna do a life altering design. I'm 49 years old. I have zero tattoos. No, never really had an interest in getting one. I've always put all my money directly back into my studio and the show. However, this is one of those milestones I think would warrant such a drastic thing as getting a tattoo. So I'm gonna put the challenge to you guys. If you wanna see this fire breathing rooster with the pentagram eye uh, tattooed on my body, then sign up, get in on the pre-order for the SMG cock blocker noise gate. And if we hit a thousand pedals before December 14th, I will go to a tattoo parlor. I will get this thing put on my body permanently and I will document the entire process and put the video out on the show just so you guys can see me cry like a little girl when I get my first tattoo. Meanwhile, production has begun on the first batch of pre-orders. Um, I'm getting a little bit of video coming in from the manufacturer. The first units are going into powder coat and there's gonna be more on that in the very near future. Uh, plus the first 600 sales are going to get a cock blocker button thrown in the box as well. So there's a still, still a few of those up for grabs. So while we still have time, please get in on the pre-order and uh, maybe I'll be getting a new tattoo for Christmas. Time will tell. Anyway, thanks so much for watching and thanks to everybody who signed up and got in on the pre-order. This thing's gonna be awesome. I can't wait to get it out to you guys. And just to show you guys that I actually do give a crap about what you have to say, we were talking about tutorials in the last viewer's comments. Well, today I had Mr. Bruno Valverde from the band Angra in the studio and we're doing a snare miking tutorial. That's gonna be coming out this Wednesday. So if you wanna learn a little bit more about miking a snare drum, making it sound good and combating that horrible, horrible hi-hat bleed, you're definitely not gonna wanna miss this episode. So until then, try and get through your Monday. The rest of the week's gonna be a whole lot easier. Check out the video on Wednesday and uh, don't forget viewers comments on Friday. And if you're gonna be in Vegas this weekend, I'm gonna be there for the URM Summit. Should be a lot of fun. Hope to see you there. And until next time, let's make some great music together. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. Links for the cock blocker are in the description below. See you later.